How's it going, everybody? It is November 7th. I'm going to take a few minutes and take you guys through the Merch Informer uh, tools that are available. This is a result of uh, a couple of you guys asking me privately if I can. Well, first of all, I, I put out a video, I think it was yesterday, two days ago, talking about, you know, that, that Christmas is in, in full effect. Like it's it's not we're not there yet. This isn't the peak. This isn't anything close to the peak. This is the beginning. But we have to understand that that people are already shopping for Christmas, Christmas specifically, right? I'm not being uh, here uh, insensitive to, to religions or anything. I'm, I'm talking about Christmas. This is business purposes, right? So so Christmas is here. Holidays are here. And I, I put up a screenshot of uh, movers and shakers through the Merchant Former. And some people, newer people, started asking, you know, what is this tool? What's going on? Basically, this is a research tool that I use. And there are different uh, number of, of tools that you can use. So I'm going to take you guys through, I think, two or three. I'm going to show you a couple of listings and, and discuss those. This thing that you're looking at right now is called a keyword cloud. And basically, it is like the most searched uh, words on Amazon on a, on a you know selected date. And usually, I use this to kind of find trends to see what's... Uh, what people are looking for and sometimes you it's very clear you can see you know especially when it comes to three word combinations what people actually are looking for today there isn't much there's no theme like you can you, it's it's all over the place like even if you're looking at the one word uh selections it's it's all over the place dad christmas ninja turkey family all that kind of stuff and even when you get more specific not much, not much is different, you know, than, than if you were to look uh, on any other day. So I'm going to skip over that. We're going to go to movers and shakers. This is what I talked about uh, yesterday or the day before. And basically, this is uh, what tracks uh, daily. It could be weekly or monthly spikes in sales. Uh, you know, you can select what you're looking for. This is Merch by Amazon shirts in general and the marketplaces the U.S., so this shows you, for example, what we're looking at, total results, average price, all that kind of stuff. So there's two reasons I'm doing this. We're going to look at a couple of designs, this one specifically. But then if you guys actually want to pause this video and, and look at this information to do your own research, you can. But this kind of has uh, some pretty cool information here that, that you can, you know, uh, kind of uh, use to customize your listings as well. If you look at the designs in general, and now I'm switching to talking about Christmas, uh, these are the same old designs. These are, you know, except they've they've updated them. 2022, right? Uh, this one we can see when it was uh, can't see here, but you can see when it was listed. Usually these one these ones, uh, what I've looked at, uh, have been listed since last year. I'm not sure about this one. Uh, we'll we'll look at that, but basically the designs are nothing different, nothing special. Like we've seen this one before, right? Uh, and, and these people are getting a, a spike in sales. Oh, look at that. Born, the good old Born brand. Uh, so so when it comes to, you know, what's selling and what, what's the difference, for example, uh, from this year, from last year to this year, we're going to look at that. So this is one of the examples that I wanted to use. This was on the movers and shakers. Uh, it, it was selling its estimated six, uh, I believe, a month for now, or I'm not sure if those are daily sales. So so this is uh, <clears throat> bumping around the Christmas tree, Christmas pregnancy mom. So I think I've talked about this last year where it's so important not to attack a holiday like Christmas directly because anything that you can think of all those designs are out there but if you make a, a design and combine it with something like else like a, like a pregnancy and and make it like look at this design it's text-based design it's the most simple the most basic design you can think of but it's creative and it's it's actually like going just a little further than christmas it's it's you know it's a it's a christmas pregnancy announcement or pregnancy mom and and this is what gets you sales right if if we look at uh, when this was posted, it was last year, November second, twenty twenty one. So you know it took a it took a year for this uh, product to to start selling again. I don't know if it's going to get traction or not, but this is uh, this is 
what works and you can see here this is the most basic uh, upload because there are no bullet points or anything so so the actual design is basic the the, the listing is very quick uh, no effort and uh, and it sells if we if we look at uh, this so this is a different uh, tool it, it, this is the trend tracker this is not the uh, movers and shakers so this kind of uses uh, uh, different information and, and I just wanted to pop this up because not because I'm going to use anything from here but just to show people that who ask me you know what this uh, platform Merchant Former uh, has and and this is the page 10 of the, tr uh, the the trend tracker and it's 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 because the first I would say five to seven pages have not changed in years it's your same old you know Disney Black Panther uh, Captain America, all that kind of stuff, Star Wars. Uh, but but this is the kind of information that you actually have through this tool. What I was looking for was the uh, merch archive. And this is, I've selected last year this uh, time frame to see what was selling. So let's go, Brandon was, uh, you know, the, the viral anti-Biden, uh, I don't even know, uh, chant that, that people, you know, uh, loved uh th there were thousands of these products and each one of them was you know making these kinds of sales it was pretty ridiculous and thing I, I think until somebody uh trademarked it and uh, you know now there are a few brands out there that, that are actually capitalizing on this design but it doesn't matter uh what i'm talking about is christmas so we're going to be looking at these two designs simply because of the numbers and, and then i'm going to compare it to to this one that i talked about so the the first one is um as the Amazon's choice for Christmas T-shirt for men. Imagine getting this, this Amazon's choice tag. I mean, that's that that would just be nuts. But again, the the same old design, but it has a bit of a different spin on it. And this is my too hot for ugly uh, Christmas sweater shirt. So instead of the you know the the ugly Christmas sweater, this is it has a bit of a spin. But but if you look at this, uh, they have actually. Uh, made this listing you know a, a little more than than basic and, and you can see that they've included the, the bullet points here uh the um the the title is straight to the point it's not using like kind of like uh, it's it they're not abusing keywords uh, it looks very professional if you go down for example you can see uh that it was uh, listed two years ago so it's it's actually been up for a while the bestseller rank is just amazing. It has a bunch of reviews. So there's no uh, doubt in my mind that this will, again, just continue to be successful. But but it is, as if you just look, just visually, look at that versus this, it is a different kind of a listing and design. Uh, the other one that's similar to this, to the last one, is the nice, naughty, innocent until proven guilty. And, and again, you know, nice, not innocent until proven guilty Christmas list. And and you can see that they have actually included bullet points. Uh, this has been up. Uh, let's see. I can't remember. I, I looked at it since last year and in August. And, and again, you know, when when these kinds of uh, listings take off, it's it's done like these people are making money. But as you can see, like the, these people actually have a product description. Uh, they have their bullet points. They have their, you know, professional looking, uh, straight to the point title, which which makes it look and feel uh, very nice and professional. So that's that's what Merch Informer is. We we've looked at a few you know tools, a few listings, and. Uh, you know the debate is over the christmas is here holidays are here there's there's a lot that's going to happen between now and the end of the year uh, but this is going to be the biggest thing right there's still a lot of political things happening in the u.s and across the world you can definitely capitalize on uh, evergreens and make money but when it comes to you know the one thing that that is actually going to rule the next two months this is it. And, and hopefully this video kind of gives you some insight on, on what to do and, uh, you know, how to make some money. So I'm going to leave it here. Thank you, guys. I'll talk to you soon.